If you're interested in AutoCue Pioneer software's integration with PowerPoint, you might want to use it with conference prompters. I'm Matt, and in this video, I'll show you how to make the most of conference-style prompting with PowerPoint. Ready? Cue titles. Before we begin, make sure you've watched our other videos on the basics of PowerPoint integration with AutoCue Pioneer. There's a link to it in the notes below. Let's start with how to set up the system. Because I want to prompt a script and trigger the slideshow, I'm going to need at least two output signals. Now, I only have one HDMI out for my laptop, so I've connected a dock to give me extra ports to use. Decide with the presenter what they want to see on their prompter. A conference setup has two prompters, so they can choose script, slides, or both, one on each prompter. For this demo, I'll assume they want everything. Why not? So this is going to need three HDMI outputs. So let's work through on how to set them up. The first two HDMI cables will feed the prompter monitors. You get one HDMI to SDI adapter in the Navigator Plus package, and I'm going to use that plus an extra adapter to feed into my SDI monitors. Remember, although the adapter has two outputs, to show different content on each screen, you need to use separate adapters. A third HDMI goes to the screen or projector, showing the slideshow to the audience. OK, into the software to configure the prompter outputs. First up, in Settings, we'll add the prompter that will show the script. Click to add a local prompter, and where it says Show PowerPoint Slide Preview, select Hide Preview. That's the script sorted. Next, we need to add the prompter that will show the slides. Your presenter can choose to see only the current slide, or the next slide, or both. And we're going to choose both. So select Only Current and Next. Only because we don't want the screen to also show the script. And we can now select the third screen for the audience output using the toggle presentation function shown by the PowerPoint icon in the prompt output. With everything set up in the software, check your monitors are flipping the image to correctly display the output in the beam splitter, and you're set. It's as easy as that to get custom PowerPoint displays for your presentation. And you can update the settings from the software position at any time to change what the presenter sees, giving them the script or slide view that they need. AutoCue PowerPoint integration not only automates your slideshow in sync with your script, it gives your speakers the most control they've ever had over what they see in their prompters during crucial presentations. It's another simple way to keep everyone happy. Thanks for watching. Until next time, stay on cue.